Well, the theft is proving not only to be costly for the victims here at Bridgeland High students and staff, it is also costly. One man we spoke to said he can't find the catalytic converter that was taken from his pickup because of a rise in this sort of crime. As for the people responsible for taking those catalytic converters from this parking lot here, well, they are now behind bars, arrested and charged. Greg Hunter was the first of three to appear before a judge. He was charged with theft aggregate. Bobby Ray Turner was also arrested in connection to this crime. He was charged with engaging in organized criminal activity. A third person, a juvenile, was also taken into custody. The, someone said that takes them less than a couple of minutes. Sam Hanna's Toyota Tundra was one of the vehicles hit. His wife, a substitute teacher at Bridgeland High. We, uh, we had to put the, a, a quick fix because even when you go to the agent, the uh, service center dealership, they, they don't have the converters. So I put the pipe, straight pipe now, just to be able to drive the car. Once he does get the parts, he estimates it'll cost about three grand. Hanna says some wiring was also cut, causing all sorts of sensors to go off. Hannah tells us he had a similar issue just three weeks ago with his white tundra. It was in a shopping mall. My daughter was attending a birthday somewhere. And then one of her friends came out and then they saw somebody under the car. They started shouting at them and the guy ran. In a letter to residents, students and staff, Cypher ISD police said Toyotas and Honda were the preferred targets. They also listed a few ways you can protect yourself. That includes installing an anti-theft device on your catalytic converter, painting it with a high temperature fluorescent paint, or having your vehicle identification number or driver's license number etched into the converter. And ISD police have added that they increase patrols in this area and are asking residents to remain vigilant and report any suspicious activity. We're live in the Cypher area, Bill Barajas, KPRC 2 News. Bill